Now welcome to our video on how to seamlessly transfer your WhatsApp data using Google Drive. Whether you're upgrading to a new phone or simply ensuring your valuable chats and media are safely backed up, Google Drive offers a reliable solution. In this video, we're going to guide you step by step through the process of setting up and using Google Drive to back up and restore your WhatsApp data through mobile trans. And also we will show you a method for doing this on your phone with the WhatsApp app natively. And now learn how to effortlessly move your conversations, photos, videos, and more so you can continue chatting without missing a beat. Welcome back everyone to the Wondershare Mobile Trans channel. My name is Francisco and today we will be talking about the best methods to using Google Drive to transfer your WhatsApp data between devices. Now please make sure to subscribe because there's a lot more content coming soon. Let's go ahead and dive right in. Part 1. Best Way to Transfer WhatsApp Data from Device to Device Wondershare Mobile Trans is a super handy tool for transferring data between Android devices and iPhones as well. It makes moving all of your contacts, messages, photos, videos, apps, and more a breeze, especially when you're getting a new phone. The interface is really user-friendly, so you don't need to be tech-savvy to use it. Plus, it works with thousands of different smartphones and tablets, so it's pretty versatile. And not only does it save you a ton of time, but it also ensures that you don't lose any important data during the switch. If you're upgrading or changing your phone to a new one and need to have your WhatsApp data transferred between devices, then we can look at the Google Drive feature with the software to make it happen in just a few minutes because Mobile Trans is definitely a must have for data transfer. Now, here are going to be the steps using Wondershare Mobile Trans to transfer your WhatsApp data between different phones using Google Drive and Mobile Trans in conjunction. Now, first, download and install the Wondershare Mobile Trans software by clicking on the link in the description. Launch the software, and from here, start by selecting in Google Drive to WhatsApp from the main interface. From here, you will be tasked with logging into your Google Drive account, so enter your credentials to continue. Then, you will come across this screen, which won't show anything quite yet. So what we have to do is go back to our mobile device to continue. So enter WhatsApp, then access the Settings tab. From here, select Chats, then Chat Backup. From this interface, you only have to select the Backup Now button, and if you've got your Google Drive account, already linked with your WhatsApp, then it will show for you or prompt you to log in here as well. So once your data is backed up, just switch back over to Mobile Trans. Now you will be able to look at a list of backups associated with your WhatsApp account. From here, you can download the backup right to your computer. Afterwards, you will see the option to view the backup click it. Once you've done so, just go ahead and select Restore to Device at the bottom. From here, you can connect the phone that you want to transfer the WhatsApp data to. So select your WhatsApp backup as the source and select your phone as the recipient. Then select Start. Wait for it to finish and once it is done, you will be notified. From there, you can enjoy using all of your WhatsApp data on your new device like always. Part 2. How to use Google Drive on WhatsApp to transfer data. This method involves backing up all of your WhatsApp data by itself using Google Drive to then re-download it on your new device. This method is very simple and we will walk you through the steps right now. Now this will apply mostly for Android devices because on iPhone you can only back up your data using iCloud and by that I mean the entire WhatsApp data that you have, not just pictures and videos. So therefore this will only apply to Android devices. Now here are going to be the steps to doing this on your Android device. Open WhatsApp on your old phone and tap on the three dots on top and select settings. Once in the settings go to chats then select chat backup. From here, you can back up to Google Drive directly. Once you're done and you log into your new device, you should have all of your data downloaded back onto your device because it's going to give you the option to just restore your data from there. Now, thank you so much for watching this video all the way up to the very end. If you liked this video, then please make sure to leave us a like and comment any of your questions and thoughts down in the comment section. Also, please make sure to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any more content coming from us moving forward and to come across more content just like this as well. Hit the notification bell to stay updated every time a new video comes out. Until next time, have a great rest of the day.